Broadcast media companies are certainly looking at artificial intelligence and machine learning very seriously. I mean, I would say all companies are, but uh, broadcast media companies, the traditional ones, uh, have to take advantage of this because their industry is faced with a number of new entrants, uh, entrants that are, are fundamentally digital. And uh, this provides those entrants with a lot of, uh, of new capabilities. In order to compete, uh, broadcast media companies have to make TV advertising more relevant. In general, advertisers view social media channels as more relevant and more targeted and more qualified. And traditional media companies have to shift that perception. Traditional broadcast media companies can use artificial intelligence and machine learning to change things in a number of different ways. They can use it to generate better content. Obviously, advertising is predicated on having good content that people want to consume. And there are a number of ways that machine learning and artificial intelligence can help people understand what viewers prefer. We're using computer vision to study audiences and to gauge audience reaction and, and turning that data into more intelligence about better content. They can use artificial intelligence and machine learning to optimize uh, advertising spend. So offer new services that will allow advertisers to better target uh, particular audiences based on their needs. We can use machine learning and modern analytics to predict viewership more accurately in advance of events and shows and use that uh, to better optimize pricing for advertising. We can also use these technologies to better manage distribution and inventory of content, exploring ways uh, to, to optimize revenue again with things like, like real-time pricing and, and, and other aspects. The technology offers a vast set of opportunities for broadcast media companies to fight back uh, against the new digital incumbents in their industry.